Hello guys, this is Right Tools, and in today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to uh, make this kind of, um, you know, glowing lines or uh, lightning effect kind of thing. So, uh, yeah, it was requested by the user. I think it was Glenn Spaz. Yeah, it's Glenn Spaz, and um, yeah, he also sent me a video, uh, and he was wondering how did this guy make these uh nice looking uh you know abstract lines that look like a bit like electricity so yeah i'm gonna be showing you guys today how to do this so uh, at the end it might look a little bit like this so yeah let's create a new file uh doesn't matter what the dimensions are i just use 1920 by 1080 okay uh, so let's fill this layer. So edit fill black, okay. And double click on the layer and click gradient and change this to just a linear gradient. And on this side, on the left side, uh, select dark gray. And on the right side, select black. And then click OK. And then change the style to radial. Um, and scale to 150 and then OK and let's drag in our text so I'm um, using this text today uh, let's increase the size hold shift and increase the size ok let's center this then hit enter when you're done and then select a brush tool and click on the text and then click OK and that turns it into an editable object okay now let's add our uh, actual lines so create a new layer uh, change the color to whatever you want just remember that you have to select the color and then select the brush tool and change the brush to uh, to this lightning brush and you can download it um, on a website I think it's breezy brushes or something like that but it's gonna be the link is gonna be in the description of this video so yeah you can download the actual set of brushes uh, there so anyways um, just click on the screen and place it wherever you want okay we'll just flip it like this okay and let's increase the size so shift hold shift and increase the size enter uh, let's put it all the way back here okay uh, now double click on it and check inner glow change the co excuse me change the color to white um, and yeah just increase the choke and size and then check outer glow and change the color to uh, to blue okay and uh, hit OK and duplicate the layer and select both layers so select the first one hold shift select the second one then right click uh, merge layers and uh, go to image adjustments uh, color balance and just add more blue uh, on the midtones and click OK so that, look, that looks nice uh, then select the eraser tool increase the size and decrease the hardness to zero and just erase like this just raise the big uh, part at the back and then duplicate the layer once again and uh, go to edit uh, transform and flip horizontal and then just hold shift and drag this across like so okay so it looks nice but 
we need to blend it in with the text so it looks like some of it is behind the text some of some of it is in front of it on in front of the text so yeah select the first shape and select the delete uh, erase tool and decrease the size until it's small enough and increase the hardness to 79 and let's just zoom in because this is gonna take detailed work okay so so it looks like it comes in here and then hides behind uh, behind the text behind the letter I okay and let's do the same thing on this side so select this layer too okay oops a little too far just kind of trim it so it looks realistic so let's decrease the size again okay so that looks good um, yeah it looks good so uh, now let's let's add some more some more of these electric lines Okay, so select, select the brush tool and create a new layer and then select another um, electric line, whatever you like. I'll just use this one. Okay. Just mess around with it, place it wherever you like. Okay. Then hit enter. Then double click on this layer. Uh, Again, inner glow, change the color to white. And outer glow, change the color to blue or whatever color you really like to use. Doesn't matter. Um, okay. Then, yeah, just increase the, the size, increase the range. Okay. Okay, so that looks good. Um, yeah, click OK. And just duplicate this layer. And then select this, the, the layer 2 copy. And then select this layer just below it. And right click, merge layers. Okay, so that just adds more glow, more brightness. Okay, and uh, now let's do the trimming job. Um, let's just delete some parts we don't want. Okay, so it looks like it comes in out of the text and behind the text again. Same thing as the other ones. Okay. Got stuck for a second there. That's because I'm rendering an intro. I'm actually gonna give out for free soon. Um, so yeah, let's just continue with this. Okay, so uh, I think that looks pretty neat. So yeah, that, that'll be pretty much it for this tutorial. I hope it wasn't too long, and I hope you liked it. And if you did like it, please thumbs up and subscribe. And see you next time.